I did absolutely nothing wrong, yet here I lay. I am in my own bedroom, staring at the shadow of my swaying foot. This experience is certainly not the first of its kind, and I truly suspect it won't be the last. I'm absolutely sick and tired of this kind of maltreatment. I used to thoroughly enjoy my renovated room, but recently it's become a symbol of dread and boredom. It's a place I'd rather not occupy. Somebody is certainly going to incur my wrath. That somebody may have to be an imaginary scapegoat. I'm not strong enough to deal with someone who can fight back. I don't want to be mean, but my options are extremely limited. My bedroom has no television. I only have a small CD player with a mere handful of CDs. Of course, I cannot play them because I don't get to choose which CDs to play. So I'm sentenced to lie here in subdued silence. Silence. For some reason, I cannot comprehend someone decided to punish me and confine me to this bedroom. Most of my close acquaintances remain outside the room. I am convinced most of them are laughing at and mocking me. Perhaps they should be confined like cage rats with absolutely nothing to do, except for quietly read the same obnoxious magazines over and over again. If they wanted to punish me, they have certainly succeeded. The solitude is much more than punishment. It's more akin to treatment. Whatever did I do to deserve this treatment? I really don't understand. Scream out loud a little. Use a bad adjective or two. Big deal. Of course, if they took care of my basic needs, I'd be as content as the next fellow. Oh, they say that I am somewhat selfish and perhaps a bit spoiled. I'd like them to take a walk in my shoes and then tell me how they'd enjoy being 84 and treated like a helpless infant.